birds are going to try to work this hedgerow up into this woods. There's a low spot in it. We're, we're going to try to go up and around and get We're just going to try to cut them off, basically. We're going to try to get in front of them. They're not talking right now. Okay. Uh, you know, they're just kind of out picking through the field. So if we can get in front of them and get our decoy set up, we might have to sit there for half an hour, but we've got a pretty good chance of killing them. Okay. The rope on that thing, good night. What kind of spurs has he got going on here? Son, pretty good daggers on him right there, brother. Whoo, man, son, man, that's a bird right there. Whoo, that is a bird. Second, second bird of the year, my straw of the wrath. I tell you what. Man, this is my second trip to Michigan. I've hunted two days in my life, the last two years, with a tag in my hand, with bold outfitters, and I've killed two birds. Last year is opening morning at the end of May. This year it's the first week of the season. Man, still April. <laughs> I decided last Friday to come up here and hunt with uh, Britt Owen and Larry Tuber, the bold outfitters here in southern Michigan. They've been after me to come back, but uh, had so many trips this year I was trying to go on, and I really got spread out too thin, couldn't make it out, but then I decided at the last minute, then we'll fly up here. So I flew up this morning, and uh, Britt's dad, Bob, picked me up at the airport. Larry met us about noon. It might be 2.30 right now. <laughs> it's just too easy up here in Southern Michigan, boys. Heck with them North Carolina birds. This is where it's at right here, these big old giant tanks up here. Man. Awesome. I appreciate it, guys. No way I'm skipping out next year. <laughs> <laughs> 